Oh hi Pamay Pai, Sight for Sore Eyes, People of Rice with Beautiful Eyes. This is your boy Mikey Bustos. People all over the world know that we Filipinos possess a look that is both varied and distinct. And one of Filipinos most well-known identifying features is the Filipino skin. Ladies and gentlemen, this tutorial is about the beautiful and unique Filipino skin. To begin, it should be noted that we Filipinos are a non-homogeneous people. We come in different looks and colors. Some of us look more Chinese, some look more Spanish, some look more like Simoan, some can look like East Indian, and some of us even look like black people. And for some reason, a lot of the young Filipinos here think that they are black. Anyway, speaking of black, one way to identify a Filipino from his or her skin is to check for an excess amount of beauty mark. The beauty mark or mole is a black, brown, or bluish dot on the skin. It can be small, it can be big, it can pop out, or it can be hairy. But if it is hairy, never pull the hair or else it will become cancer. For some reason, Filipinos tend to have so many beauty marks. Why? Because we are beautiful, of course. It is as if God, every time while creating a Filipino person, says, I will create him in my own image. God, are you going to add beauty marks? Yes, Michael, plenty. He is so beautiful, I'm going to add beauty mark here, 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 oh yeah, and down here. Yay! Filipinos believe that a beauty mark in any specified spot in the body points to a greater significance and meaning. Lola, what is this? Michael, that is a beauty mark. You have it over your lip because you are talkative, madaldal. Lola, what is this? That is also a mole. You have it on your finger because you are makulit. So I learned that God put beauty marks on me to accentuate my personality. My mouth has moles because I am madaldal and talk a lot. My arms have moles because I am strong. My fingers have moles because I am makulit and crafty. My legs have moles because I like to travel. Even places that the sun don't shine have moles because... Balot kasi. If I were to use a pental pen to connect all the dots of my many moles, I would look like Spider-Man. Filipino skin is also super smooth. I used to laugh at all my non-Filipino girlfriends saying, Ah, I have smoother skin than you. You are like Sasquatch compared to me. Oh my god, is that a woolly mammoth? No, that is just your leg. It is because I eat so much rice and you eat so much potato and bread. We have like no hair anywhere except the places that count. I'm already almost 30 and I still cannot grow a proper mustache or beard. If I try, it will just look like I have a kind of black lint on my face, as if I'm eating dust bunny. Many Filipinos seem to have a fascination for light skin. It is as if they are trying to be like Michael Jackson. But if you ask me, it does not matter if you're black or white. In fact, I would not be surprised if the evil queen from Snow White was a Pinay. Mirror, mirror, on the wall. Who is the fairest of them all? Well, in fairness, it is Snow White. Nako? Talaga? Speaking of queen, one theory as to why Filipinos tend to like light skin is because it suggests that you are from the upper class. Because it means that you are not outside working in the sun. Here in North America, it is the opposite. Dark is beautiful and it means that you have money to go vacation and have time to sit in the sun and tan. Whatever the case, all Filipinos know that the secret to having light skin is good jeans. Good jeans. Many Filipinos will stay out of the sun, encourage their children to stay out of the sun, and take all measures to stay light-skinned. They will use umbrella, whitening soap, whitening creams, whitening pills, skin bleaching, scrubbing your skin with a rock, any lighter and you will be glow in the dark, my goodness. I love that my skin can be both light and dark. It is like I'm a kind of delicious chocolate rainbow, my goodness. The best part about Filipino skin is it takes forever to age. Basically, I have drawn up a Pinoy age equation. First, guess the age of the Filipino, then multiply that by 1.5, and that will actually be closer to the Pinoy's real age. Sige, try it! So, the next time you see a Filipino, do your descendants a favor and marry them so your kids can enjoy the smooth, beauty mark, pear, and ageless Filipino skin. Ciao, Singao, your heaven-sent pigment.
Life is so good when you God, are you going to add beauty marks? <laughs> it can pop It can pop out It can pop out I'm sorry boys We're going to need your ID please Uh, yeah mm -hmm. Thank you Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I don't buy it. What do you mean? Buzz off, that guys. is real. Are you We're kidding me? He's you almost win. 30. Scram, kiddos. Don't you know who he is? He's Mikey Bustos. Yeah. He's not joking. What? He's Are you really kidding 29. Me? That's his real ID. Come on, you gotta Check let us Wikipedia. Get your lolly. Sus. <laughs> Cannot believe this. Can you believe that they are trying to calculate the end of the world with an equation? Do they think that I am that stupid that they can calculate the end of the world with some numbers? I distinctly wrote tip in the night. Manny Pacquiao and Mayweather haven't even fought yet. 